we have seen the structure and type of neurons and i have also kept saying that the electrical impulses are created and travel through the neurons well how does this happen where will the current get generated how will it move through the cells and between the cells and when or how will it die down really curious questions and interesting to know so let's dive in all body cells display a membrane potential which is a separation of positive and negative charges across the membranes as discussed in the chapter on cells this potential is related to uneven distribution of sodium potassium cations and large protein anions between the intracellular and extracellular fluid two types of cells take advantage to get their work done because of this difference the nerve cells and the muscle cells nerve and muscle cells are considered to be excitable tissue because when they get excited they change their resting potential to produce electrical signals nerve cells use these electrical signals to receive process and transmit messages whereas in muscle cells these electrical signals initiate contraction thus electrical signals are critical to the functioning of the nervous system and the muscular system